you know, it's going to be another long off season. I think you guys just need to stay focused on the task at hand. I think this was a great learning experience for our younger guys in terms of coming back next year. It's painful not to go out on top um, when you want to come back and do so. Um, but I'm, uh, I'm excited to hand the torch off to these guys. They're going to do a great job. Clemson is good as advertised. Clemson's a great football team. They're well coached. Got a lot of great players, a lot of playmakers. And uh, I'm looking forward to, to watching them uh, next uh, Monday. True. How much does this one hurt? It's, it's painful. Um, you know, uh, you want to go out on top, you want to be a champion. Trained so long, put so much into it. So this will this will sting for a while, but I'm excited for what the guys have in store for them. What we have coming back, yeah, an opportunity ahead of them. What was Clemson able to do that uh, allowed them to have so much success against you guys? I mean, their game plan was pretty simple. They were just trying to spread us out and run RPO and get the ball on the perimeter and then take big shots downfield. You know, out, outside of their one run they had, they didn't really get anything done in the run game. Um, and they were just able to make the big plays they needed to to win the game. Um, credits to them. Their balanced offense and it, when we shut down their running attack early, they were able to go to the air and the quarterback put the ball in a nice position and the receivers went and made plays. Obviously, this loss hurts, but do you take any pride or a moment to just think about how special this season has been for Notre Dame? Yeah, I'm sure I will at some point tonight or tomorrow or in the coming weeks. Uh, just trying to relish this with uh, with the guys, and uh, it hurts. It hurts when you're a competitor. Um, so it'll take me some time to, to kind of reflect and get over that first.